So my name is Alon Ativ and I'm from Malaysia Lechet, Israel. We are the only funeral home and crematorium in Israel. We also do own a cemetery. Uh, we came here to the United States to provide a new service or to launch a new service, which is ash scattering in the Holy Land. Um, what we find out during the years is that a lot of people ask us to bury it or scatter the ashes in the Holy Land, in the very holy location like the Sea of Galilee, uh, like in Nazareth, Bethlehem, Jerusalem and other locations. When I mention those sites, it already indicates that I'm speaking not about Jews, but also for Christianity. But we find out that most of the people uh, prefer to have to be buried, scattered, kept the ashes next to their home. Therefore we launched a new service which we provide. We provide a new service and to send only a small portion of the ashes to the Holy Land. Which creates a symbolic act but very powerful one and still people can choose where they want to scatter or bury the ashes in those holy locations. We provide them the service, they don't have to be there. We do the service, filmed it, put it on the website so they can have a full documentation, including a video, on the website and to see what have they done with the ashes. So it's an add-on story which empowers the memory of the deceased. And this is what the families are getting. Naturally, for funeral director, it's another service they want to provide and another maybe profit to add to their uh, package. Which is uh, why you're here talking to funeral directors yes. about it. And you have this beautiful book uh, that you've brought. Yes, we did. Uh, this beautiful book is actually kind of a catalog and album all together. So it's providing information about us, and it's providing information about the services, and it's providing information about Israel and the locations that we're able to do. Uh, it's created and built uh, for both religious Jews and Christianity, and it's also um, using it as an album that could be located mm -hmm. in the welcome room of any funeral director, which means any client could see it, read about it, get curiosity, ask the funeral director about it, and allow him the opportunity mm -hmm. to sell him the package. Very interesting. Now, of course, traditional Jews don't cremate. I assume that today in the United States, approximately 30% of the Jews are cremated. This is, uh, this is true. Yeah, I mean, so, uh, among Reformed Jews, but certainly the more Orthodox wouldn't uh, do that. The more but Orthodox, they might ship their bodies. That's true. Whole but, burial. But in any <laughs> case, before I answer about the, the shipping the bodies, I say yes. Jews, Orthodox Jews, does not do cremation, but you can see it is Orthodox Catholics or Greek Church or other church does not do cremation. But it does increase during the year as well in their uh, parish as well. But in any case, we provide those people a full service. So we have our own cemetery including for uh, Jews, one cemetery for Jews and other cemetery for uh, all religious so they can be buried in a cemetery in the Holy Land as well. So funeral directors here in the United States would get in touch with you in Israel and you would take care of uh, getting the cremated remains to exactly. Israel and, and scattered in exactly. wherever they say they want to be. Exactly. We're able to take care for everything. Actually, when we are speaking about a small package, as I demonstrated before, we provide it with the envelope, with the package, with the box, with the documentation. All the funeral director has to do is fulfill the form, take it to the next post office, and that's it. There we take care for the rest. Okay. We keep it simple as much as we can. And do you have a website? Definitely. We have a website. It's in our catalog. You can follow it in the uh, lead over there behind me, uh, it provide all the information, there is a public information for all people and a different section for the funeral directors that would like to be part of our network. Very good. Thank you. Thank you very much.